folks, with Samsung's latest foldable phones now official, the industry is slowly turning its attention towards the company's next flagship phone. A fresh rumor claims that one of the key upgrades employed by the upcoming Galaxy S23 Ultra is a larger and more accurate fingerprint sensor supplied by Qualcomm. The new rumor states that Samsung's upcoming Galaxy S23 Ultra will use Qualcomm's 3D Sonic Max fingerprint sensor. The sensor is already out and has been used by a couple of Vivo devices, including the X80 Pro. Back in 2018, Qualcomm was the first company to introduce an under-display ultrasonic fingerprint scanner, the 3D Sonic sensor, the same piece of technology that was first embedded under Samsung Galaxy S10's display. The next year, the US company announced an upgrade to the ultrasonic fingerprint scanner called the 3D Sonic Max, which promises to accurately scan a fingerprint in three dimensions. Unlike the first iteration that only allows users to scan one fingerprint, the 3D Sonic Max lets you scan two fingerprints at the same time. The 3D Sonic Max version of Qualcomm's ultrasonic fingerprint sensor offers a recognition area that is 17x larger than the previous generation, allowing for increased security via simultaneous two-finger authentication, increased speed and ease of use. Assuming that the latest rumor is accurate and Samsung plans to upgrade the Galaxy S23 Ultra's biometrics with the addition of Qualcomm's 3D Sonic Max, the end result will be a speedier sensor with a much larger scanning area, which means lower authentication times and fewer misreads. The Galaxy S22 Ultra already had an upgraded sensor capable of delivering much better results compared to previous Galaxy flagship models, but the competition has already advanced to the next level and Samsung will want to keep up. The Galaxy S23 Ultra should offer even faster and more secure biometrics. It's unclear if the entire Galaxy S23 series will use this new fingerprint sensor from Qualcomm or if Samsung will reserve it for the top tier Ultra model. We'll keep you posted as soon as more details emerge. Moreover, the Galaxy S23 Ultra is pretty much guaranteed to have a bunker's 200 megapixels main camera. Another industry report reiterates Samsung's alleged plans to equip the upcoming Galaxy S23 Ultra with a 200 megapixels camera. According to industry rumors, Samsung's mobile experience division has confirmed these plans with its major camera partners in preparation for the Galaxy S23 Ultra's release next year. Samsung stuck with the same megapixel count for the last three generations of premium S-range handsets, and while some may argue that the unit provided more than enough megapixels, it's been a while since Samsung announced its 200 megapixel sensor, and the South Korean company is probably itching to launch a device with it. Samsung announced its first 200 megapixel smartphone camera, the Isocell HP1, last year, and in June, the company introduced another version of it called the Isocell HP3. The recently launched Motorola X30 Pro is the first smartphone to feature the HP1, and Xiaomi is also said to be working on a 200 megapixels camera phone. If you are wondering whether Samsung skipped the HP2 version number, that's not the case. Apparently, it exists, but Samsung has reserved it for the S23 Ultra, and it is expected to have different and perhaps better specs than the HP1 and HP3. Thanks to advancements in computational photography, the megapixel count is no longer that important a metric, which explains why Apple and Google try to avoid megapixel wars. But it continues to be a major selling point, and per today's report, Samsung will highlight the 200 megapixels camera as a standout feature. It's not like high-resolution cameras don't have their own advantages, though. More megapixels lead to gain in performance and help phones churn out detailed photos, and ETNU says that the Galaxy S23 Ultra will offer significantly improved photos and videos. Samsung hasn't announced when it will introduce the Galaxy S23 series, but chances are that the company's next big unpacked event will take place in January or February 2023. Anyway, guys, I'll keep you updated, so please subscribe to our channels. Thanks for watching and good luck everyone!